Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Emily Lucy Wretch. If you're new here, I've got an Instagram account, a TikTok account, and a YouTube channel. So if you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. Today I'm using a new camera to film on. So fingers crossed, this looks okay. Um, we're gonna test it, but if it doesn't, please let me know in the comments if you prefer my previous videos or if the lighting is okay on this new camera because I just want things to be a little bit more easy for me to film more quickly. So anyway, I digress. Today's video is a sponsored one. It's sponsored by Boohoo and I'm going to get straight into this because I'm going to be testing out some trends that I just love but I'm not 100% sure how they look on a mid-sized body. So let's begin. I just want to make things right. So... I've actually got three big bags here to share. Before you ask, this is also from Boohoo. It was part of my previous Boohoo haul that I did last month. If you wanna see that, I have linked it down below in the description as well. A lot of those items are still available and loads of you have asked for this shirt. I haven't really taken it off since I got it. It goes so nicely. Bodysuits, joggers, it's just such a comfortable piece. But I also picked up one in my new favorite autumn awesome color, which is brown. <laughs> so of course we have to start with this item. Again, oversized shirt. This one is a bit thicker, I would say, than this one. And this one I got in a 14, it's a little bit too oversized, whereas this one I've picked up in a 12. And I'm excited to try this on because I feel like, as I've already made clear, brown is just such a great color for this autumn. I've, I'm wearing it with so many different things and I am so here for brown. Like I just think it's such a rich, gorgeous tone that goes with so many different skin types. I just love brown. So this is the first thing I'm gonna be trying for you guys with bodysuit and joggers. So I've got the shirt on, I've teamed it with a bodysuit and some brown joggers as well. Gold jewelry, so I've got my Apple Watch on with the gold link and this bag with the gold strap as well. Just tying all the different warm shades in together. I absolutely love the shirt, I feel like it'd be perfect. To just wear like an outfit like this where you're running errands or maybe a Sunday or you just wanna have a bit more of a comfy look. Might be even going to the airport. I just feel like it's a really easy to throw on outfit. This shirt is like not too thick, but also not too thin like I feel like I'm very warm in it on a sunny autumn day and then I think it also looks really nice dressed up so you could have it fastened like this and then put some black leather tight leggings on and some black boots and then again just team it with this gold jewelry and I feel like it dresses it up as well like I feel like it's a really good universal shirt you could even put like a hoodie underneath it I've seen hoodie underneath it um and yeah, I just think it's just a really nice addition to wardrobe for the next few weeks while we're in between getting it colder. And then continuing with the brown theme, I feel like it's everywhere all over Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, you cannot avoid the whole brown ensembles right now. With that has come these really amazing style of leather trousers. So they're not leggings, they're not like a tight black legging that we wear. They are a full blown leather trouser, like Ross from Friends, Christina Aguilera chaps, like that's the vibe they're giving me. So in my mind I was like, mm, are they gonna be a thick thigh friendly? So I bought a few pairs, so let's give it a go. It could be a hit or it could be a miss. Let me know in the comments what you think to this idea. So these ones are in the kind of like leggings material. So they're not like a thick trouser. So I thought these ones might be a good place to start. They've got this like V waistband, so I'm hoping that's quite flattering as well. And I'm gonna put a bodysuit underneath that to make sure I'm getting pulled in under my little tum area there. Then I also picked these, which are a little bit more of a trouser. So they've got like a button, a zip, and they've got this really flattering pleat down the front. And you guys know, I love a pleat to lengthen the leg. I just think it makes it so much more flattering. So I'm gonna try and compare these two. So if we wanna go for more of a legging style or if we wanna go for more of a trouser style with the pleat, let's see which looks the most flattering. First of all, with my hair like this and this outfit on, I literally am having flashbacks of my school disco, being in like year, year five and going to my primary school disco, wearing this hair, these earrings and something very similar to this outfit. So I definitely feel like I am reliving my youth being 31. <laughs> the bodysuit I had so many high hopes for because I absolutely love this print. I feel like it's just so nice and it does fit. This is a size 14. The only thing is like, it's just so high in the body. Like I like my bodysuit to be a lot lower and it's just literally like so high. That for me is like uncomfortable. So it's a shame because I do actually really like the print of this. So if you have someone that's maybe got like a smaller torso, you probably can get away with this or if you might want to size up. Um, and then the 
trousers again i don't hate them i think they're actually a lot more flattering than i expected these are the 14 there's there's loads of room like they're so so comfortable um yeah they're not rippling too bad here i think i might just change the top because i feel like like i said i'm getting flashbacks of being at a disco when i was a child um, so I'm going to change the top to one that I think is actually a bit better fit and then I'm going to try the other version of the trousers on. Okay, so now going on with the top that I think fits and is comfortable from Boohoo again. This is a roll neck bodysuit. Um, it definitely fits a lot better. I actually do think that the trousers are really flattering and they really lengthen my legs. I'm actually really surprised how much I like these because I thought they'd really highlight my tummy area here and obviously that is a little bit of an insecure point for me because I just feel like in certain fabrics the light can like really hit you here and actually make this area look bigger than it is um, and that for me when I look in the mirror and I see that that's something that triggers it for me where I think oh I don't like what I'm wearing. So actually I'm quite shocked in the fact of how I feel in these, I do think they're really nice. So now I've put it with this chocolate coat, which again, I got from Boohoo in my last haul. And just the colors all together, I literally, I'm shocked how much I really like this. I thought it's gonna be a trend that, you know, you see and it looks great on like models and things like that. But actually in real life, I feel like this is a very flattering style, a very flattering look that all the colors are working together in a really nice way. I feel like it complements my body shape. I am shocked, okay? Like I was, kind of setting this up to fail because I really thought it wasn't going to look good because I just, you know, I assumed, but I'm completely wrong. As I said before, I can admit when I'm wrong. So yeah, I'm really into this. Okay, so these are the 16 that I'm wearing and I do feel like they are super tight, but also like they fit a little bit too low. Like I thought they'd be a little bit higher in the waistband. Like I can just tell that's going to happen. Um, so personally, I wouldn't go for these ones. I'd go for the ones I just had on. Um, which is a shame because I did really like the detail and the actual shape of them is really nice but I do think these ones come up a little bit smaller but they are still nice and if you're somebody that's not maybe got um, as chunky a thighs as me maybe you can get away with these they are a really nice thick quality material but personally for me I think the other ones definitely win this challenge well in the brown shade department I also came across these shoes and Lord, I am in love. They're like a caramel macchiato shade and I love them so much. I reckon these are gonna be super flattering because they don't have any straps around the ankles so they're gonna really lengthen the leg with a lot of these looks. And this is like oh, squidgy. You just know they're gonna be so comfortable. They are beautiful. And I feel like they're just gonna go with so many things. How nice. I'm obsessed. Even the heel is just a statement. Square, I just love these. Oh, I am so happy that I got these. Squeegee. <laughs> I'm so superstitious that I will not, I refuse to put them on the table, they're gonna go on the floor, because I just can't. Everything in my power is like, put them on the table. No, they have to go on the floor. In my last Boohoo haul, I shared a gilet, and everyone has gone mad for this gilet. I, I, it is partly my fault as well, because I've posted it on TikTok and Instagram, and each time it's got such a good reaction, so it did sell out very, very quick. So instead, I've tried to find an alternative, because the ones I've been sharing, they're very similar. Whereas this one is slightly different, but I feel like it's gonna be a vibe. So it's not as long as the original Gilet that I showed you guys from Boohoo before, but it has a hood, so it's a bit more practical. And the key selling feature for me to pick this up was this belt. I feel like it's gonna be so nice and flattering. Just pull you in at the waist. Because obviously with the Gilets, they can be really like bulky and just create a lot of size. So having that little bit of a waistband to bring you in and create a bit more of a fluttering shape, I think it's gonna be really nice with a hoodie, sweatshirt, leggings, more of a chilled Sunday vibe. So I'm gonna try that on for you now as an outfit. So I've got on the gilet right now and I'm gonna show you how it looks with it fastened. It's really thick, like I can feel it's gonna be so nice and warm and chunky. And I just feel like having that belt just brings it in and creates a bit more of a waist rather than it just being completely oversized. I do feel like this will be really nice for like, if you've got a dog, you're ready for a walk, you know, it's like very casual Sunday style gilet. Um, and then if you have it open, it still looks equally as good. It's just very oversized, obviously, and chunky. And um, it's got a nice little hood on the back. I just think it's a really nice, different style of wearing a gilet compared to the one that I showed you last time that I know you guys really liked. I'll link both down below um, in the description for you if you did want to have a look at any of the items that I am showing you today. 
Also, last week I shared on Instagram this post showing the difference with going for like a really chunky, thick hoodie that's oversized and why it's like longer, it just doesn't do anything to flatter, especially a mid-size body shape. It just drowns us, especially if you're petite, you're just gonna look really stuck in a, a, a big oversized hoodie. And loads of you guys are asking for suggestions on where to buy these lightweight thin hoodies from. They are hard to find. So I shared last time with you guys on my previous Boohoo haul, a hoodie well this is the gray version so the black one was on the other video this one is the gray version again it's just look you can actually see i can see my hand through that it's not too thick it's gonna look gray layered it's still warm it's just such an essential honestly for autumn to layer things up mix and match outfits create different looks this one does actually come as a set it comes with these joggers as well i think it's like 20 pounds or something like that so you get both and it's just super comfortable i just think it's so nice to just even if you don't wear the joggers out you can still wear them in the house and stuff but you get this hoodie as part of the set and then you can mix and match and wear them different ways or you can even wear them together if you wanted to so this is how the hoodie looks on obviously like i mentioned it's very lightweight it's not too hot you can layer it really easily i will say i personally prefer the black version of this the only thing is i don't like how um it can be like two colors when you wear gray um but it is a really nice essential to have in your wardrobe so you can mix and match because sometimes wearing all black can just look way too much whereas obviously having a gray hoodie in your wardrobe to mix with lighter shades it's just such a nice essential to have and like i said the lightweight hoodies are just so hard to find so it's good to have that option of having it in your wardrobe if you need it to mix and match and build outfits with this autumn winter and then i'm also working on some more of those posts because you guys really love them and i get so many dms and shares from those because i love posts so i thought about what i'm going to do next and you are getting a little sneak preview of what is coming next and that is for anybody who really wants to lengthen the arms or flatter the arms or you personally feel slightly self-conscious about your arms and wearing anything so you would never wear just like a bodysuit on its own showing your arms off you always like to be covered then I've got some really great tips for you when it comes to choosing the right tops and again this is something I'll explain on that post but I'm going to go into detail here and that is going for tops that have this three quarter length sleeve I feel like they are such an amazing little piece to have in your wardrobe. So the first one is this one. This is only available in plus size. I just really wanted to show you guys this style of top because I think it's just so nice. So not only is it three quarter gonna flatter your arms by having this three quarter length sleeve and then this nice little ruffle, it's also got this peplum. So if you're someone who maybe is conscious of your arms and your stomach and whenever you look in the mirror, you just feel a little bit critical of yourself because you're choosing the wrong items, then going for a top like this that's three quarter length sleeves and then does have this little peplum, you're gonna put it on and instantly be like, wow, love my outfit, feeling good. I am gorgeous and that's how you should be feeling when you look in the mirror we don't have to lose weight we don't have to serve ourselves to be able to wear things that are fashionable you just have to choose the right items which is why i do a lot of these videos and different posts like the one i've just mentioned so that's the first one i'll try that on for you now so this is top number one as i mentioned i feel like it's very flattering here because it has this little frill on the sleeve which again is really nice to give a little bit of eye catching detail here on the arm and then it shows off the most flattering part of your arm which is here and then it has this really lovely peplum which goes over the little tummy area as I mentioned there. This one as I said is a size 16 so personally I think I'd want it to just come in a little bit more there to create a little bit more shape so it's such a shame they don't do it in a 14 but if you're somebody that wants to have like a nice comfortable top in there so say if you are a 12 to 14 you could definitely get away with wearing this a little bit baggier or if you are a size 16 um, plus then I do think this will be really 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 a great staple to have in your wardrobe I just love how girly and cute it looks it's so fluttering like I said it just works to really complement a mid-sized body shape so this is the other one and I am completely obsessed with this so I'm hoping it looks as good as I can imagine it is again three quarter length sleeve so this one's a little bit longer than the white one but it's just showing this part of your arm which is always the most flattering part of your arm and then it's a shirt so it's going to give you a little bit more of a neck here but then it has this a wonderful part here that brings you in at the waist creating again more shapes so it's just showing all of the most flattering parts and then this one i got in a 12 i mentioned the sleeve 
area here is really flattering the shape of it it really brings you in it's fitted on the shoulders here the shape of it is just absolutely lovely and a great staple to have in your wardrobe this autumn winter pair with leather leggings normal leggings jeans you can do all sorts with this it actually would be really great as a work staple as well and it's just super flattering because as i mentioned it brings you in at the waist here creates this nice little bit of shape here and then it's flattering on the arms showing in the most delicate part of your arms to the bottom okay so i hope you enjoyed that this was a little bit of a mix match of a video i wanted to obviously try all the different trends that are in at the moment with the leather trousers i wanted to show you some style suggestions of how things can be a bit more flattering and also show you all of the good new in bits that boohoo have at the moment so i hope you enjoyed this video if you haven't already please make sure you subscribe give this video a thumbs up and i will catch you in the next one guys thank you so much I just wanna make things right.